Hey guys, what's going on? Back with another video, another Topps Chrome 2020. I uh, got it again from Target. Uh, there were a bunch of these on the shelf, maybe about at least 10 boxes. Uh, I did really well on the first one. I think it's about to hit maybe seven or 900 views. And I always say if, it, if something does well and people like it, I'll buy more of it. And usually I'll do like one or two videos just to get a feel to see if people uh, are interested in uh, different things. Usually like wrestling cards or or whatever, even NASCAR. Um, I think the secret is though, and I mentioned this a couple years ago when I first started. Uh, you gotta kind of look at like what people are putting up on YouTube. There's not that many probably wrestling channels or wrestling cards that are being opened or even baseball. I remember at the time... Most people were doing football and basketball, and there actually weren't a lot of people doing baseball. Uh, so that was the other thing. Uh, at one point, there weren't many people doing baseball. But I guess there's not many, like I said, wrestling cards being open. And probably like most people, I am a big fan or was a big fan at some point in your life. Uh, again, uh, I, this is box two. I did a first one. I ended up getting kind of like a hot box. It had like a... I think it had a super short print and, and an autograph. Uh, I think the sh the uh, the short print was numbered. I can't remember. I think I'm thinking even like down the five, uh, but I don't remember exactly. Uh, otherwise, you get seven packs. Um, each pack has, I believe, four. Okay, four cards in a pack, and then um, so that's 31 cards total, because you get three X Factor parallel cards. Uh, the thing with tops, you're not guaranteed any hits, unfortunately, but I do feel you do get uh, a decent chance of getting some hits. Uh, keep in mind this is wrestling, and it's probably not as po obviously not as popular as as baseball or even hockey that um, I think they do. Do they do hockey? I'm not even sure. Um, this one feels really thin. So here's the uh, bonus pack I'll do last. Uh, just kind of mix these up a little bit. Hopefully get another autograph. Maybe even some really short prints. Uh, legends. And I mentioned last time the female wrestlers are the ones that are the most popular nowadays it seems like. And some people tend to agree with that. Uh, that the wrestlers are pretty much uh, running the show when, whenever it comes back on, on TV and, and live. Uh, okay, so the first one is Shinsuke Nakamura. And a next uh, wrestler, Boa. And Candice LeRae. And the first uh, parallel... Not, well, it is technically a parallel chrome. It is Eric. Not short printed. A refractor. I mean, it's technically a chrome refractor, maybe. Uh, if you want to get technical. And if you're new to cards, you'll notice that it has a rainbow finish on it that the, the regular base cards don't have. Uh, so that is kind of like the first somewhat hit. Well, no, not really, because I think you're guaranteed one per, per pack. If I remember correctly. I think you're guaranteed some type of... Uh, uh, <clears throat> refractor. Alex Alexander Wild? No, Wolf. <laughs> Alexander Wolf, base. Travis Bank. Base. Oh, and a really, really nice. This will probably be really popular. Uh, Ric Flair, Legends. Might maybe is it printed? No, I'm surprised it's not short printed. It has a signature figure for a leg lock move. Uh, obviously, easily top three uh, favorite wrestlers of all time for most people. And another refractor, Bobby Lashley. Uh, so that is actually two refractors. The Ric Flair one I got to be careful with because there's some huge Ric Flair fans. I'm just going to make sure I don't damage that if I ever want to sell it. Especially that it's the refractor version. 
Or maybe he only comes in refractor. Sometimes the bigger names you only put in the uh, uh, chrome or refractor. Uh, Kobe Kingston. Humberto Carrillo. And a really another nice looking card. Finn Balor defeats Roman Reigns. Shocking wins. Uh, and that is not short printed. Alistair Black. Another Chrome parallel. I should probably separate these at least. Maybe I'll do kind of a recap at the end. Um, but like I did mention, you do get a decent amount of of uh, refractor chrome. Drake Maverick Brock Lesnar Asuka and a Nakamura um, Chrome Refractor uh, So there's three packs left Walter, Triple H, and Bailey, Refractor, and a Triple H Refractor. So kind of like I mentioned compared to the other one, unless I, I missed it, there are no short prints thus far two packs left so you either hit or miss with these as always Lana Jeff Hardy Eric and the Lana Refractor And last pack, then I'll do the bonus pack. Bobby Lashley. Alistair Black. Oh, here's a good one. Uh, the Rock versus Roman Reigns. Anything with The Rock, obviously, will be very popular. And a Jeff Hardy refractor. So those, like I said, you do get pretty much, I'd say, one per pack. And last is the X-Factor ones. Sasha Banks, Ricochet from Raw, and Nikki Cross. So, like I said, just compares to the the first one. The big difference, nothing here. Did get the Ric Flair car, which is pretty nice. But you are never guaranteed much with tops. I think that's pretty much it. Again, at least you're getting a lot of chrome refractors. I think when I'm done, I'm going to go online and see if this is worth anything on eBay. Or what people are paying for it on eBay. Uh, but the chrome ones look amazing. Alright, I'll see you guys later.